Happy now, a live look in the courtroom where closing arguments are underway in the murder trial of a Buckhead attorney, Tex McIver. Tell us who's Mike Pachinik is live in downtown Atlanta with what lawyers on both sides of the case told jurors. Mike. Well, Fred, Tex McIver admits that he shot and killed his wife, Diane, but the question for jurors will be whether he murdered her or whether this was an accident. Today, in the uh, closing arguments for the prosecution, they told jurors that Tex had a financial motive to kill his wife, that he owed her money, and that she was going to foreclose on his interest in their Putnam County ranch to bequeath it to their godson against his wishes. Defense attorney Don Samuel told jurors Tex loved his wife. They were like teenagers in love. In fact, he told jurors none of the case makes any sense, and the jurors need to use their own common sense to come to one of the most important decisions they'll ever have to make. Confident. But the evidence in this case has proved that the defendant is guilty of every count in this indictment beyond a reasonable doubt. If you have one reasonable doubt, you don't have an option. At that point, your verdict must be not guilty. A Tex MacGyver is now facing five charges in this indictment, including murder and influencing a witness. The judge announced this morning that jurors will not be able to consider a misdemeanor charge of involuntary manslaughter, but they will be able to uh, determine a charge of involuntary manslaughter on the felony level, which carries a much lesser penalty than a murder conviction. Those closing arguments are continuing. We'll have the very latest on this case starting today on Channel 2 Action News at 4. Live in downtown Atlanta, Mike Pachenik, Channel 2 Action News.